I'm gonna brush your head. I'm gonna, I'm gonna brush your head. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna brush your head. I'm gonna, I'm gonna brush your head. Head, head. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna brush your head. I'm gonna, I'm gonna brush your head. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna brush your head. I'm gonna, I'm gonna brush your head. Head, head. Make sure you visit the Validated Center booth located right inside of our lobby this evening. Once again, our referee in charge of this bout, Mylon Ayer. And now, introducing to you first, fighting out of the right corner, he is wearing black trunks. He is training out of Romero's Boxing Academy in Riverside by way of Beaumont, California. He is one hundred and forty three and pounds. His record, one win. No losses with that single win coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Matthew Benneke. His opponent across the cage fighting out of the blue corner. He is wearing white trunks. He is training out of rock and roll MMA in Ventura, California. He weighed in 144 and one half pounds. Tonight, he is making his debut. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Rick Sakamoto. Rick Sakamoto, all business. Matthew Benneke with a huge crowd here behind us. Traveled from uh, whatever, whichever part of California he's from. I didn't catch it, but uh, he's got a lot of support with him. We'll see how Sakamoto handles it. Seems very comfortable in the ring, too. Very. Very nonchalant. We'll see how that plays out. Touch of the gloves, and we are underway. Sakamoto in a Ooh. southpaw stance Sakamoto here. starts off with a big one-two, lands on the two. This is a wild one. Sakamoto, push kick left hand. Might look to get it to the ground. Beneke coming forward, just winging Haymaker. Throwing this. technique to the wind, ladies hey, and gentlemen. This is a high kick, pops right back up. Sakamoto looks to be, I don't know if he's dazed, or what happened there? That head kick might have touched him. I don't think the head kick caught Ooh, him. His knee was a little low. Be. Both fighters retouch, show, show a sign of respect here. Whatever it was, was an unintentional. Spinning hook kick for Beneke misses. Sakamoto in on a double leg, oh. and Beneke pulls guard. He might have that guillotine, That's Kev. That's very tight. Arm in, but it's still very tight. Sakamoto doing all he can. He might have to tripod up here. He wants to throw his left arm around the neck of Beneke. Oh, Beneke was able to finish the choke from there. Arm in guillotine from Beneke. Second submission win for him. He's going to improve to 2-0. and oh. Probably around the same amount of time, too, as his last one. Huge win, Matthew Beneke. I, I'm, I'm, I'm aghast here. I'm at a loss for words. The fight started out being very untechnical. Throwing hands crazy, but ended up being a pretty technical finish. Nice job by Matthew Benneke. Turn it over to veteran ring announcer for the official decision. Jim Fitzgerald. At 54 seconds of round number one, referee in charge, Mylan Ayers stops the contest due to a tap out from a guillotine choke. Our winner in the red corner, he is still undefeated. Matthew Benneke celebrating with his corner. Huge first round. 
I guess that was a rear naked choke. First man, ar arm in guillotine, actually. Arm in guillotine is what you called, right? Yeah, arm in guillotine, very tight, too. You can see uh, that, that initial choking arm was real deep under the neck. Sakamoto just had no answer for it. He tried to peel the arm off, but it was too deep. That escape to that is very technical. If you don't drill it over and over and over again, it's real easy to get caught. And Beneke set it up. He pulled the guard. You know, it, 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 it was it was almost like uh, uh, Sakamoto decided to go for the takedown, and Beneke said, "Okay, fine." Yeah, he left his neck out there, and, and, and Beneke took advantage of it.